Jack Stoners, what's up? Welcome to another local band. Smoking Armor host is Adam BG. And today we're doing an awesome album review. The band is going to be Disappearance. Uh, the album is called Humanity Pending from Madison, Wisconsin. Facebook.com slash Disappearance Band. They're listed as metalcore slash post hardcore. That's kind of the assumption I came to. Um, <clears throat> but before we get started, we must do the sponsors Youngblood Productions, Dirty Radio, Hex Elzier Designs, Boost AK Integrity Products, Octave Studios, Jason Trevino Tattoos, and Vape Out located at Big Bear and Alpha Valley. Stop in, use code LBS15, and they will take 15% off your purchase right then and there. So if you've never seen an album or EP review here, where basically I've already jotted down notes for every single song, and then I, I'll read them out before we hear the song, and then we have an album assessment at the bottom that gives a score. Don't be cheating and don't look and see what the score is. Watch the whole video. Um, I do about a minute and a half snippet of each song. Otherwise, I'd be sitting here for like 50 minutes and I'd run out of weed, smoking all that weed in front of you guys. <laughs> I get boring. But uh, the purpose of that is so that if you enjoy any of the songs, you go and grab the album yourself, Humanity Pending, or uh, discover the rest of the songs that you like and get them individually. It's pretty cool. So Disappearance, Humanity Pending, this is going to be track one. Wolves Among Sheep intro song. It's got a cool filter pan sweep in the beginning. It explodes right out of the gate. Um, it's got a little bit of a hip hop influence at parts, but it's literally just absolute madness in the song. Really cool, clean section. And I put a star next to it. It's one of my favorite songs in the city. It's track one Wolves Among Sheep. Track two, to my dismay. Uh, it's got a way different feel than the beginning of the song than the previous track. Uh, it's got some really cool dual screams, possible single for the band. And then I put this is gonna be a fun review because I'm absolutely loving what I'm hearing so far. So let's get to track two. Check it out. To my dismay. Yeah. 
Hell yeah, now we're on to track three, Substance Domain. This one has one of those, yeah, one of those cool little, I just put that, yeah, I don't know how, <laughs> what you call those, but I love those things. So sweet drum fills going on, uh, more awesome dope dual screams, some cool synth sections also, and it has a really sweet break section. I don't know if we get to the break section in the snippet, but it's worth going and getting this album and checking it out for yourself. Substance Domain, track three. so far hopefully you guys are too well, we're gonna break this up into four parts my camera only records in like 10 minute intervals I don't know why it shuts off automatically after about 10 11 minutes so we'll be right back with part two with disappearance all right and we're back with part two of disappearance humanity pennings you guys are from Madison Wisconsin facebook.com slash disappearance band this album is excellent so far we've made it to track four declaration <clears throat> cool guitar tone going on in the beginning I love the bass on this track. Basses don't get a lot of love. I don't know why. They deserve it. Um, but I really love the bass on this track. The dual hook uh, with screams and cleans going on at the same time is pretty sweet. Uh, it's another song that would probably sound insane live. That's what I wrote down. Track four, Declaration. This is America, the hell of the sight We can call us a surprise To avoid it, we stand as we dig our own grave We sit here on faith with the face We're dishing up in the pain and pain And declare us a sin Track 5, Greed. It's got a star next to it, one of my favorites. Dope guitar harmonies throughout the entire song on this one. And the, screaming, the screaming hook, there's a screaming hook on this one instead of having cleans, which the other four traditional songs did have. <coughs> uh, great, great, great high screams on this one in particular. Another track that has a little bit of a hip hop influence too, so look for that. Track 5, Greed. Yeah. 
hip hop going on right there. <clears throat> Even though Attila is totally not hip hop at all, but you guys know what I mean. That was Greed. Track six is gonna be called Specific Notion. Uh, it's kind of a cool, creepy intro. Um, the drums sound extra awesome on this one. Uh, there's a really cool, nice, quick break that happens. Uh, it's got a good hook, probably my favorite clean hook so far. And super evil low screen with a smiley face. Track six, specific notion. Children of Decay, more amazing high screams on this one, just slightly popish hook going on on this one. Uh, <clears throat> then they go right back to the heavy madness, followed by some more, yeah, some more of those, which I love. Children of Decay, track seven from Disappearance. Here we go. The popish, not poppy, popish hook. But please go check it out. We're gonna take another break right now. Facebook.com slash disappearance ban. Go like that page during the break. It's only like a one second break, but uh <clears throat> They're from Madison, Wisconsin, disappearance for doing the humanity pending album review. Come right back. Alright, Sonners, welcome back to part three of our disappearance humanity pending uh, album review, facebook.com slash disappearance band. They're from Madison, Wisconsin, and during the break I thought it'd be cool to go put my Vikings jersey on. Uh, so you guys are pro probably Green Bay Packer fans, so cheers. <laughs> uh, track eight is gonna be Dark Matter. This one's got like a really, really big, huge intro. Cool synth sound, 
Uh, more of an intermission track, really than anything. It's not. It's kind of like just breaks apart the album a little bit. But this is track eight, Dark Matter. It's almost like movie score music right there. Track 9 is going to be Humanity Pending. Um, some parts in the beginning reminded me of Slipknot in, in this song. Um, some people may disagree, but I heard some Slipknot influences in this one. Tons of different kinds of screams going on this track. There's like, the dude screams like four or five different ways, which is awesome. And it's got a really cool, like, pretty piano break at one part. So track 9, Humanity Pending. Oh yeah, I guess that little pre-hook is that one little part I thought it sounded like something just for like a second. But anyway, track 10 is Blinded featuring a guest solo by Steven Lesko. That's got a really dope drum intro, crazy heavy drop breakdown, uh, more cool synths way in the back of the mix, insane solo, and it's got a star on it because it's definitely one of my favorites on the album. Alright, this is Blinded. Yeah, that's the best. So you're 
It's crazy after that part. <coughs> Alright, so I'm going to take one last break, then we're on part four. We've got two more songs to do, and then we're going to do the album assessment and see what the score is. We'll be right back. Alright, we made it to part four of the Disappearance Humanity Pending album review. I'm very stoned right now. Faces.com slash Disappearance Band. They're out of Madison, Wisconsin. Probably Packers fans, that's why we're wearing the Viking jersey. Uh, we're up to track 11. We've got two tracks left. Track 11 is called Westland, almost like a Kraftwerk synth in the background. Kraftwerk was like a late 70s, early 80s band, maybe. They were like a really like computer robot sound band. Anyway, uh, more awesome screaming, and it's got like a really awesome sweeping solo. I think I was like, oh, really fast and shit. All right, so this would be track 11, Westland. Here we go. Track 12, the outro song. Um, yes, oh, it's called Get Low, by the way. And yes, it is a hardcore metal cover of Little John's famous song, Get Low. It's pretty hilarious and it's yet yeah, awesome at the same time. Track 12, Get Low. Here we go. assessment. This album slaps hard as fuck. So many dope tracks. It's actually hard to point out what I really didn't like about this album. The screams and vocals in general are just amazing. My only criticism is some of the clean hooks could be a little bit tighter, uh, but that's about it. 
everything else is excellent. The drums stand out on certain tracks, the bass stands out on other tracks, the guitars on other tracks, the vocals on every track, but everything was just really good and was produced well. Very, very heavy album that will for sure be on repeat for days to come. My favorite tracks were Blinded, Greed, Wolves Among Sheep, and To My Dismay. Get this album. High score alert. It's going to be a 9.2 out of 10 for me. I really, really enjoyed this. Everyone, please go to facebook.com slash disappearance band. Like their page. I believe this album comes out today, the day you're viewing this video. So we kind of synced this up uh, like a week ago or so. They're from Madison, Wisconsin. And uh, probably see you guys in the playoffs. If you're not football fans, then ignore what I'm saying. <laughs> yeah, but anyway, that was the Humanity Pending album review from Disappearance and it was excellent, 9.2 out of 10. If you're in a band and you happen to want an album or EP review yourself, go to facebook.com slash local band smoke out. Make sure you like the page, watch the video at the very, very top that auto plays. It'll explain everything you need to know. Other than that, I'm on Instagram, Masters, YouTube, Twitter, and Snapchat. Cheers. Keep blazing. Peace.